Welcome to my July summer styling video. I am really excited to show you guys today's outfit. We've got a bit of colour in there. I'm not going to lie to you guys, the weather in the UK right now is so tragic that if I wore any of these out, I reckon I'd get some weird looks, but we're going to manifest some sunshine. And if it doesn't come, I will be on the next flight out to Ibiza because I just need some sun. I'm bored of the rain. I'm bored of the rain. Anyway, let me show you all of these gorgeous looks. We're going to get started with a little neutral number. I mean, there's always going to be some neutrals in one of my videos. I really love this little outfit. So we've got these cute little ribbed shorts from Misguided, which I've been wearing non-stop. I got them about a week and a half ago and they are just the comfiest shorts ever. They're amazing to lounge around in, but you can also kind of dress them up like I have in the clip. Then we've got a little white crop top on and then this cropped blazer. I am still so into crop blazers at the moment, but I just think they look so good. I've got way too many colors of them and I really hope they stay in fashion. Um, but I really love this like beige one from Misguided. I'm finding that I'm grabbing this one quite a lot at the moment. Next up is a little bit more of a dressy outfit. I'm hoping that we will be able to go out at some point this month. Apparently we're gonna be able to, um, but fingers crossed we will because the date for going out has been pushed back a lot. Anyway, this is the look. So we've got the famous Zara green blouse. I feel like everyone has this, or like every influencer and blogger, I just see it all over my Instagram. And then we have this little skirt. Um, it kind of looks like a skirt, but it is actually a skirt, which is amazing. This is from Bershka, but I really like this. Like I was saying about the shorts from before, I feel like this can really be styled up and styled down depending on the mood for the day. But I really love this little outfit. I actually wore it when it was sunny a couple of weeks ago and I just feel like a bit of a boss bitch in this outfit. I just, I think it's great. I feel like this, the score is a nice length that it like makes me look tall, even though I'm not, it's just good for the legs. So I really love this outfit. Another outfit that makes me feel very powerful is this little yellow floral dress from Bershka. I don't know what it is about this dress. I don't know if it's the way that it's cut or the way that it fits, but I just feel amazing in it. The fabric is quite similar to the House of CB dresses, you know, the ones that everyone's wearing at the moment, um, but they are quite expensive, like they're over 100 pounds. This was, I think, under 30, um, or definitely, definitely under 40. It was really affordable, um, but I really love it. I love the pattern, the fit is amazing. The only thing I would probably say that I'd want changed about this dress is maybe to be a bit longer. It is a midi dress. I feel like this as a maxi would just be an absolute showstopper um, but I do love it like it's so gorgeous hopefully Bershka will bring out this kind of style in different patterns because I just really like the way that this sits on my body in particular moving on to something a little bit more casual now I really love this outfit so we have these high-waisted mum shorts from H&M I've actually I think I've got a couple of outfits featuring these because they are just amazing like these are the most perfect shorts I've had in years genuinely like i didn't think i could fall in love with a pair of shorts as much as these but i really have um, and then we've got this little it's actually a bikini top it's from zara last year but i'm sure they've got something similar um i've never actually worn it as a bikini top i've literally just worn it as a crop top and then we have my classic monkey blazer this honestly i've had for about two years now i do think they still sell it so i will link it down below if not i'll find something really similar but i just think this blazer makes every outfit look amazing it literally goes with every everything like the color of it is perfect it matches every single color in my wardrobe and i'm always always grabbing it so yeah really love this little outfit I don't know what London life is doing to me, but I feel like loads of these outfits in this video are really classy. Um, I think it's the area that I live, like there's lots of posh mums, yoga mum people around here and you know what, they look like they're living their best lives. So anyway, this outfit I really love. So we've got this beautiful dress from H&M. I honestly rave about these dresses all the time. I just think they fit amazingly. They're just the easiest thing to wear, but they look very sophisticated and classy. And then to kind of amp up the look a little bit, I've paired it with this oversized satin shirt. I feel like satin shirts are really good in this kind of weather because they don't really add too much in terms of like warmth, but they add a little bit of coverage like on your arms or on your body because this is a very exposing dress so obviously at the top it's literally just like a bandeau style so i find that i've been picking up the shirt a lot when i've been wearing dresses with this style just to kind of 
I don't know, like cover up a little bit if that makes sense. Um, but yeah, I really like this outfit. I just, I feel, I feel like a classy yoga mum. I feel like one of the ladies where I live. So um, yeah, I'm into this. I'm very much into this. I want to show you this little pink blazer look next. I was actually going to show it last, but I feel like the middle is the time when this outfit needs to shine. This blazer, honestly, is one of the best things that I own. It's from Misguided. It was really affordable. I picked it up in a size 8, although I would suggest sizing up. I wish I bought it in a 10. Um, and then I'm pairing it with this little bralette. This is from Bershka. I'm not going to lie, it was actually bright white, but my boyfriend accidentally put it in a black wash so it's it's a bit grey now and um, so I'm hopefully going to try and get the black out of it if anyone has any suggestions I've been like vanishing it I've been putting in you know the whiteness stuff but it's not really working um but it, it kind of looks white I feel like on the camera it looks it looks white um, and then I'm wearing it just with these little mum jeans just because you know summer you can wear skirts you can wear shorts but I actually find especially where I live is I just wear jeans. I go for jeans a lot. I just think they're great. They're a great all year piece for me. And I love these ones. These are the H&M mum jeans and they are just incredible. I feel like H&M denim is really pulling through this year. Like I'm very, very impressed. Outfit number seven, I think this is number seven, is one that I don't think will ever really go out of fashion. Like I can see myself wearing this in five years time, 10 years time. I think anyone of any age group can also wear this. So you've got a classic white shirt. This is kind of like a summer take on a white shirt. It's got a slight brodery lace effect. Um, which I really like and I think it helps it look a lot more expensive because this is just a misguided shirt, like it was quite affordable. And then we have my trusty ASOS linen shorts. If you guys watch my channel a lot, you're probably annoyed at how much I wear these shorts, but I genuinely could not recommend them enough. They just fit amazingly, they go with absolutely everything in my wardrobe. They worked for spring with like little cardigans and jumpers, they're working for summer. They're probably going to work in autumn as well. I mean, probably not a winter outfit. But, like, these are the best shorts that I have in my wardrobe that aren't denim ones. Like, I am just loving them. And they wash really well. The quality is amazing. Like, they literally look brand new, in my opinion. So, yeah. I really like this, this little outfit. I think it's very cute. Bringing back the mum shorts now for this next outfit. This, I guess, is kind of similar to the one that I showed you earlier. Um, but I really wanted to show you guys my new blazer. This is a linen, I think it's like a linen blend. I don't know if it's pure linen, but it's from H&M. And I absolutely adore it. It's quite oversized. So I picked this up in a medium. Probably could have got a small because this honestly is like, it's like a dress. If I do this up, I could honestly like wear this out as a dress. Um, and then we just have a little black crop top on underneath. This is a really nice outfit. You can style it up with heels and it can kind of look like dressy, you know, out for brunch. Or you could just whack it on with trainers and it will look really casual. Like it's honestly such a versatile little outfit and I can't wait to style up more pieces with this blazer. I'm sure you'll be seeing this a lot over the next few weeks. You guys, I hope, are gonna love this next outfit. So it's literally just a cord. It's from Misguided, but I just love it. It's honestly one of my favorite things I've ever picked up from Misguided. I am obsessed with it. So obviously it looks really nice as the cord, but I've actually been wearing the top a lot with like blue jeans, cream jeans. It goes with everything. I am just absolutely in love with this outfit. Like, I could not recommend this enough to you guys. If you guys are, you know, planning any brunches or like any nights out, I just feel like this outfit is the one to go for. I just couldn't recommend it enough. The quality is amazing. The fit is good. It washes well. So I have no complaints. I just adore it. And I really hope that they bring it out in like a Oh, like a pink colour or like a sage green. Oh my god, okay, misguided. If anyone from misguided is watching this, bring this out in a sage green because I will buy like five of them. The final outfit today is giving me very like ladies' day, wedding guest, day at the races kind of vibes. I really love this, and I'm not gonna lie, it's not one of those dresses that I would usually wear, but I wanted to show it in today's video because I don't know when I'll be able to wear it on Instagram, and I wanna show you it before it sells out because I can imagine this is gonna be really popular. It's from an Australian brand called Forever New. Um, I really love their stuff, like everything on their website is beautiful, but there was just something that pulled me towards this dress, and it honestly is like the only thing I have like this in my wardrobe. Um, but I really adore it. I'm going to horse racing, I think in August. I might actually save it for that because I think it is 
just beautiful and she definitely deserves her moment at some point in the summer um, so yeah I really hope you guys like it as well so that is the final outfit today I really hope you guys enjoyed this video as always please do let me know your favorite look down below and I will see you in the next one bye